And to new at six, a recent Wisconsin Supreme Court ruling allowing the use of ballot boxes, it has led to confusion. News 9's Wyatt Williams talked to a number of people to get their thoughts about the changes and one clerk who's working to clear everything up. Yeah, the state Supreme Court has done an about face for the last two years, saying back in 2022 ballot drop boxes were not allowed. Now they're saying they are allowed, so you could see more of them coming up this fall. Can they or can't they be used? That's the big question surrounding ballot drop boxes, a hot topic since the 2020 election. The most recent ruling from the Wisconsin Supreme Court says you can use them. A point Marathon County Clerk Kim Trueblood is working to clear up. I want to make sure that voters understand the Wisconsin Supreme Court ruling that they are allowed to be used for this election cycle and if you see them in front of your city hall or your village hall or at your town clerk's office, don't freak out, don't panic. The Supreme Court did rule that they are allowable for this year. Terry Wolf and her daughter Amber are Wausau residents and completely support the idea of drop boxes. I think they're a wonderful idea. I, if, if, I don't like crowds of people, so I just want to come in, drop it off, and be done. And I don't see how it causes cheating or anything like that because they're sealed boxes. So I trust it and I like it, like the idea. Another member of the community I spoke with supports them, but only if they're strictly regulated. I vote absentee myself. And um, in the future, I don't mind having them right here in front of the city hall, but not all over town. Um, people misuse too much of everything. While I found a couple of people to talk in support of the drop boxes, many more who wouldn't go on camera don't like them. It's an issue we'll continue to follow closely through this election cycle. And the Wisconsin Election Commission did, dis, uh, did say they will discuss guidance to give local officials on these drop boxes coming up at a meeting on Thursday. Stay tuned to News 9 to find out what updates those are. Live in Wausau, Wyatt Williams, News 9, WAOW. Thank you, Wyatt.